Yo, what's poppin' YouTube? It's your boy Braytone, and today's video I'm gonna show you guys how to mod Super Smash Bros. Ultimate on the Yuzu emulator. Now, since Smash Ultimate is fully playable on the Yuzu emulator, that means you can finally install mods. So that makes, technically, there's two methods of modding this game. One is through having a modified switch, which is kind of hard to come by, and you will need custom firmware to even set that up. And second, you can play on PC with the Yuzu emulator because due to the fact it's fully playable, that means you can install some mods. So first things first, this is gonna only take like max two to three minutes. So this is a really good process. I'm gonna link you guys to the Game Banana website. And this is the website where you can find a lot of game mods for the Nintendo Switch, like Super Mario Odyssey, Zelda, uh, Pokemon, Animal Crossing, all the popular AAA Nintendo first party titles. And this and this website has been known for having mods for past Smash Bros games like Smash 4. And now they're really active with the Smash Ultimate mods, which is pretty good. As you can see, almost every day there's a new mod. Like two hours ago, somebody just uploaded a Samus mod. As you see, let me show you guys real quick. I think it's like this Smash 64 Samus costume mod, which is really cool. And other good stuff like that. And yeah, I'm basically gonna show you guys how to set this up essentially. First things first, I'm gonna set up this mod. You always go to manual download and then press download real quick. I'm gonna wait for it to finish downloading and I'm gonna minimize my tab. I'm gonna drag it to my desktop. Close this, minimize this. Left click the game, open mod data location. Put this up here, open this. And then basically just drag and drop it here. You close it, you open up the game and you're basically good to go. So that's, let us open it up real quick. Usually when it, when the game can launch 80, 90% of the time, that means the mod is capable with the game. So I'm gonna wait for it to boot up real quick. Passing, yep. It usually works like that. When you, when it can boot up to the game, the emulator, that means the model, is, it's the model is capable of working most of the time. So yeah, that's basically it. I can't show too much gameplay due to the fact that my video might get claimed by Nintendo, but that's basically I wanted to show you guys how to basically mod Super Smash Bros. Ultimate on a PC with the Yuzu emulator. It's much more simpler and easier than having a modified switch and. I know that I know having a modified switch and trying to mod Super Smash Bros. Ultimate for the very first time is going to take at least 30 to 40 minutes. And I know that's a that's a drag for some people. So yeah, that's basically about it. If you guys enjoyed the video or find this video any helpful at all, feel free to leave a like, share, and subscribe if you guys are new. And I see you guys in the next one. Peace out, guys.